Hello everyone. On this video, I will introduce you to Geoda software. Geoda is used for geostatistic analysis. It is developed by the University of Chicago. If you would like to try the software, go to the following address and then choose the most appropriate one based on your computer system. For instance, for Windows, you can download here, download for Windows. And then choose the most appropriate one 64 byte or 32 byte download and install the geoda on your computer and after the download has been completed just go to the windows start button click and type geoda okay this is the first windows of the geoda software at first we will try to open the data there are four choices for you to open the data just select your data and drop file or just browse using this button choose your data and mostly in GIS the most famous data is S3 set file next we can also choose from the database for example from PostgreSQL or PostGIS database also from web if you have a URL of GeoJSON and finally from the Carto datasets okay in this example we will use a sample data uh, Columbus crime okay just click here and the map of Columbus map will be opened at first we can explore our data from this table button we can open the attribute datasets and check our datasets here we have, uh, for example, income data, crime data, prime data, and etc. Okay, just close here. At first, I will show you how to make a quantile map, for example. Just click map, choose quantile, and choose five class. In this case, we will use uh, crime. Click OK, and this is the quantile map of crime if we click on the maps it will be corresponding to the this map here yeah it is very convenient for analysis next we can also use uh, exploratory analysis for instance we can choose histogram and choose income and this is the histogram of income if we click on the Instagram, this will be also corresponding to the maps. Okay, this is the income. You can also choose another exploratory data, for example, scatter plot, which is the independent is uh, crime and the independent is income. Okay there is a negative correlation between crime and income we can also choose to make some cluster maps for instance we will make a cluster based on k means algorithm just choose your variable for instance uh, crime variable number of cluster is 3 and run ok this is the cluster maps of crime there are three cluster yeah this also corresponding from the, with the map another analysis is using the space data for instance univariate models but at first you have to make some weight using tools and weight managers go to tools and weight managers here we create a new this is the red names, just create new one and selling the ID for variable columns for instance. Okay. Is everything okay? Just create and put the new data here. Yes, exit. Okay, we close. Go back again to space, unifariate models. 
first variable is crime the weight is columbus crime and just click ok and this is your graphic of morans next you can also use the regression here the regression between income and crime for example the dependent is crime and covariate is income let's click run okay we can see here the adjusted our square is 0 0.47 around 47 percent of crime is due to the income conditions this is very suitable for the analysis in socioeconomic case okay we close here next we can also do some uh, analysis for example using the this one this is conditional map variables we can compare three different uh, variables for instance crimes income and plum condition just click ok and you can find here the area yeah this is a very high crime and this is a very high very high income high income has a negative correlation with crime this is the crime location situated here on this area high concentration of crime even and this is a high income and plum condition so this is a very convenient for analysis of socioeconomic uh, cases okay that's all for the introduction to the geoda you can explore by yourself using your own data set thank you